Good evening, you're watching BBC East Midlands Today. I'm Emily Anderson. Two people have been charged with murder after a fatal stabbing in Nottingham on Christmas Day. Police were called to Woolerton Road just after 8pm on Monday. They say Rhys Connor, who was 29, had a single stab wound. Arsonists have torched the clubhouse of a cricket club in Nottinghamshire. Emergency services were called to Mansfield Cricket Club off Rosemary Street at around 9pm. On The high winds have been causing some disruption across our region. At Sherwood Pines in Nottinghamshire, trees were damaged, which meant temporary closures and diversions on a number of trails. Meanwhile, Elverston Castle in Derbyshire is expected to remain closed until after the new year due to the risk of falling trees and branches. Next tonight, a rescue centre in Leicestershire is stepping up security after a horse was horrifically mutilated and died in Lincolnshire. The RSPCA is urging people to be extra vigilant after the incident in Grantham. Now, we're not showing images of the injured horse as they're too distressing. Helen Astle reports. People living in Leicestershire are being urged to have their say on major cuts being made by the County Council. A consultation started and will run until the 17th of January. The proposals include a council tax rise of almost 5% and plans to cut growth in spending. Leicestershire Council's hiring out bigger bins to help residents dispose of excess waste after Christmas. The largest bins are four times bigger than the usual size and